Thank you, Madam Chairman. I ask unanimous consent for one minute to revise and extend my remarks. Without objection, the gentleman is recognized for one minute. Thank you, Madam Chair. Not long ago, America was the largest energy producer in the world. Gas was affordable, and groceries weren't worth an entire paycheck. These are not faraway memories from our country's bygone golden era. This was the reality for Americans just a few years ago. Government spending has increased over $9 trillion since President Biden has taken office. This predictably resulted in the highest inflation in four decades. American families have had to bear the brunt of this crisis, yet my colleagues on the other side of the aisle still seem to have no plan to tackle inflation outside of spending more taxpayer money. House Republicans have been clear about our mission in 2023. Set our fiscal house in order so that we can lower the cost of living for Americans. We can find solutions to our joint uh, debt crisis by working on new budgetary framework focused on fiscal restraint. Republicans' commitment to America offers tangible solutions to set us on that path, from strengthening our supply chains to enacting pro-growth policies. Madam Chair, I yield back. Thank you. For what purpose does the gentleman from 